It all started with a briefing. The season 25 Nash range was about to get launched, but due to COVID-19 it would be difficult to get the team to Hawaii for the photo and video shoots. Nash came up with the idea to have the riders work with local media to create a worldwide launch video. I got to shoot the Dutchies part with Stig Hoefnagel Hard nipples. and Kohan van Dijk some sick jumps. with some help from my buddy Thomas Roos for extra video shots and the photos. Gotta love your job, right? Now you have to understand, we have some very sweet spots for kiting in the Netherlands, but the sport is also highly regulated and during the summer months all our spots get really crowded, so the timing could have been better. We scouted some classic Dutch locations, when we finally got some wind we set out for an epic spot. We tried uh, the first spot, it was like a, a little dam with a lighthouse, it was like a perfect scenic shot, uh, until the owner came and she kicked us out. So this is what we came up with, it's Schelling House, like really nice and flat, some typical Dutch. <laughs> It was a bit too much for freestyle. When we started freestyle and it kicked in like 30 knots, so we, not much freestyle for that. So we pumped our pivots and the monarch and stuff, and we did some free riding, and uh, I think uh, we did a good job. Ja, leuk, hè? Ja, graag. Lekker. Ja, leuk. Was u dat? We tried to get the freestyle shots, but the wind picked up quickly and it became more of a big air session. There was a nice backdrop in the harbor, but after an hour in, we were sent away again. Luckily, we got some sweet shots in, but this was not what we came to do. So, we tried another day. It's pretty early. Uh, we arrived here at Schevening, it's day two. It's gusting up to 45. <laughs> That's gonna be kind of sketchy. Cone is changing already. Take a shit, Ola. Scheveningen is one of the few locations in the Netherlands where you can get that sweet angle with a kite loop because you can stand on a small pier looking downwind. So we got there early, rigged up, ready to go. But after 30 minutes in, we were sent away again. So the plan B for this day was to go to the big pier of Scheveningen. And finally our luck changed.
Dude, like there's sand, I think, in every single possible hole I have. We did some like shots under the pier, and like all the wind got compressed like under the pier. And dude, it was so fucking strong. I think it was like 80 knots. Like, I think we got some, some proper shots here. Nice. It was fucking this windy. Man. <laughs> I'm, I'm tired. The angle like this with the kite going in front of the guys is like, that's insane. I think we made a good call. We still didn't manage to get the freestyle. So we had to find a flat water spot with no one around. In summer in the Netherlands, that's a difficult thing to do. But we managed to get it. We had an epic sunset session. Probably some of the best shots of this whole shoot. Cohen couldn't make it, so Steg had to do the honors. did we do just now really good my uh, eyes literally don't see anything anymore right now but the camera does i think we shot for like three hours plus and we had like an amazing sunset it's a nice day i mean if this is your office it's not a bad office try to do a kind of border over the little dam over the pier over the pier Officially, never ever forget my harness again. I promise. <laughs> I think it's in a forgettable uh, mood today. So first, <laughs> you forgot his pump, then you forgot his harness. Yeah. I don't know what I'm saying.